gonna have to work. So hey everyone, it's Joyce with MommyTalkShow.com. This is my first official scope of my daily scoping challenge every day in March. Um, if some of you may know, I used to work in local TV news for about 15 years, and then I became a mom and all that went, oh, thank you. This is, um, what is this eyeshadow? Yes, every day. I'm gonna, I'm gonna be on Periscope every day at one o'clock. I used to be on TV every day. I should be able to do this every day. What is this eyeshadow? Oh my God. It might be Bobbi Brown eyeshadow from like a thousand years ago, but I love blue eyeshadow. So in case you're just watching, this is Joyce with Mommy Talk Show. I live here in Atlanta. Some of my blogging buddies, you can already see them in the chat, are here in Atlanta too. So I wanna kinda talk about why Atlanta is such a good place for bloggers. And you haven't been doing it, well, get on it. Get on it, do them at 115 and I'll tag you. So well, I want to talk about why bloggers, such, why Atlanta is such a great place for bloggers and why there seem to, many, seem to be so many great events here. But let me talk about the events first. And one of them that I am participating in and Mama Demix, who you just saw in the chat, we are uh, performing in Listen to Your Mother Atlanta. So it is when women write original essays about motherhood and we um, perform them on stage. So if you know anybody who loves this, thank you, Michelle. Yeah, there are lots of great bloggers here. So if you know anyone who lives in Atlanta or wants to attend events, if you guys could swipe and share this on Twitter, it would be great for them to see. And I hope some of the brands see it too. Um, there are so many great events here. You know, Atlanta is a hub of the South. Um, we have Coca-Cola here, we have Georgia Aquarium here, we have a lot of great um, national companies here. The world's largest airport is here. The world's, I should say, the world's busiest airport, Hartsfield Jackson International Airport is here, which I have the pleasure to fly out of all the time and it makes it so much easier for friends and family to come visit and it also makes it um, a great place to host events because people can get here easily and Delta and Southwest both fly here. So that makes it pretty good. Um, what else? There's a lot of great things for kids to do here in Atlanta. Our son is six. Well, he's about to turn six, two weeks from today. So he gets to enjoy all those events. And let's talk about bl the blogging community because some of the Atlanta bloggers are already here on this um, scope. It seems like most of my in real life friends here are bloggers, meaning they have their own sites, their own social media profiles, their own followings, their own um, community that they serve. A lot of them um, blog more about fashion and beauty than I do. My blog is definitely more lifestyle, but I do throw in beauty every once in a while, like my shorter haircut. Um, I cut my hair last June because I just needed a change. And I had a lot of breakage in the back of my hair and I was tired of like trying to do twist outs and trying to hide what was breaking. So I just said, Psh, let it go, cut it. And I've had like, well, there was the initial cut, maybe three trims since then. Not a whole lot because my hair curls up. If I put gel in it, I can kind of hide it. So Atlanta bloggers, so let's talk about that. Um, there are a lot of great bloggers that host their own events, in-person events, vision board parties, other events, stores and major brands hire them and me to um, participate. I was happy to participate in a fashion show with Macy's, oh, was that almost two years ago? With the uh, world's first plus size supermodel, Emmy. And there really is just a great community here of people being able to support each other and um, show what we're doing. So why don't you guys tell me, give me some comments and some questions about, you know, blogging here in Atlanta, what it's like. Oh, and the most important thing is that a lot of conferences come here. So Blogalicious has been here. Type A has been here. Um, there's another one that I can't remember. Oh my gosh. I think they've since moved further out west. Um, it's like mom, so fab has been here. How could I forget? So fab. 
I spoke at SoFab on the road when it came here in Atlanta. And Michelle lives in South Carolina. Mom 2.0. Thank you, Danielle. That's what I was trying to think of. So Mom 2.0 was here um, a couple of years ago. Um, Michelle lives in South Carolina. So like she was saying, she could drive here. Um, and it seems to be a good hub because it's centrally located and there are a good number of Atlanta influencers who could come and be like ambassadors for some of these events. So like last year I spoke at SoFab U on the road about YouTube, YouTube videos and we did it, hi Marge's World, we did it right at the um, Embassy Suites in downtown Atlanta and it was great. Yeah, Blogalicious will be here in Atlanta uh, November I want to say. Yeah, so I know a lot of people come for that. Type A is going to be at Walt Disney World this year. It's not going to be here in Atlanta. So there are a lot of great events that do come here. And like I said, it makes it easy for folks who live in the Southeast to drive or, you know, makes it fo easy for folks who live elsewhere to, um, to fly in because we have a great airport here and great deals and stuff. Um, with South, between Southwest and between Delta Airlines, you can always come here. Yeah, you can always do something and be involved in bringing those conferences and events here to Atlanta too. They really are great. So um, we just have a great community here. I'm glad that some of these major corporations have realized the importance of having bloggers. Um, even Family Dollar has um, a blogger outreach or I should say a group of influencers or ambassadors. I'm a family dollar blogger and they hosted an event here for us um, at the Intercontinental in Buckhead. It was several days. There was concerts. There were makeovers. It was great. It was like a two day vacation. It was a lot of work. You know, it was like a little bit of a vacation from home and then not so much of a little vacation from work. So there are great. And there's so many hotels here that can really make it um worth it for events to be hosted here. So is anybody coming to anything here in Atlanta blogging related in the next year or so? Anyone coming to Blogalicious or any other events that they plan to come to? Michelle from Divitude, are you coming back to Atlanta for anything? I can't see who all is working for my viewers. Let's see. Go back. Go back. If you sent something, I missed it. Amir is coming to Blogalicious. Anyone else? I don't know. This might be the year of very little travel for me. And it is great because the conferences and events are here. They called me, so I had to decline that. And what else? That's all I can think of right off the top. But I do want to remind you guys, for anybody who is in Atlanta, like Crystal, I would love for you guys to come out and support um, me, Danielle, 12 other women who are all taking the stage April 23rd at the Theater in the Square in Marietta for Listen to Your Mother. Listen to Your Mother is a book, and it's a series of performances, live performances, all around the country. Um, lots of bloggers and influencers actually participate. They submit. We have to write something. You have to audition. We're just about to start rehearsals. And um, the tickets are $20. But 10% of the tickets go to the Drake House in Roswell, which provides short-term emergency housing for mothers and kids. Because although... Um, you know, Atlanta is considered a pretty affluent area. There are a lot of people who still struggle, even nearby affluent areas. So those moms and kids are able to get short-term housing. They learn how to save. They learn how to budget for folks like Amira, who are more frugal folks. And it helps them get back on their feet. So that is it for me. I will see you back here tomorrow at 1 o'clock on my Mommy Talk Show Scope. <coughs> I hope you guys can support me every day in March. See you soon. Bye.